Another ingredient, um, we're looking at today is, uh, is peppers. Peppers are, um, about as broad of a plant family as any other family that we've seen, right? Like from hot to sweet, to hard and bitter, uh, to black, we've got about a dozen or two dozen, maybe varieties here of different peppers. Um, in this case, we're using and doing a, uh, raw pepper compote and it's something we've adopted from uh, potato salad that we did and in the potato salad we used celery specifically um, to produce a somewhat viscous sauce but what we do for this is a, a nice brunoise of pepper we salt the pepper and squeeze out extra moisture and we juice any trim that trim gets hydrated with xanthan gum and i'm not talking about like a nice level of hydration i'm really focused on snotty you know as as viscous and ridiculously thick as you can go with xanthan gum you don't need much you just need a little bit and we add it back over those brunoise peppers and we put them in a bath at 175 degrees for 10 minutes and it just brightens them up. Part of this presentation, you know, in the headline of it, that you all signed up for is improving on fundamentals, you know, finding, you know, using modern technology uh, to refine the fundamentals of cooking. And, and I think that's really important because you know, I'm not trying to say like, we're gonna uh, improve on everything, but there are some techniques that can be applied with the kitchen um, that, that just make things better, you know. In this case, uh, raw celery compote. We don't have to hammer this. And traditionally you might take a, um, you might take like, you know, fruits or something and you, you, you cover it in sugar and then you cook it down until it's viscous. This is raw, barely, barely blanched, just to brighten up. Uh, it's super crisp, uh, really flavorful, and quite interesting. I wish I could show this to you. But maybe you can see it. Probably not. 